Hello friends, welcome to BISPTrainings.com. My name is Sumit. This is my second video in continuation of creating dashboards. In this video, we'll be going to see how to prepare a dashboard basically for CFO of a company. And in the dashboard, we'll be going to represent the income statement analytics. So what exactly my requirement is, I would like to prepare a dashboard which represents the net sales, net profit and profit margin. And it represents the net profit, net sales and profit margin in a dashboard. And this dashboard will be going to represent to the CFO. So this he will be able to understand the profit margin between net sales and net profit. So first of all, we should have a look of the data. So we are using the same data as we have used in previous example. So here you can see we have a column here, scenario, year, period, view, region and financial elements, which contains the net profit and profit margin and net sales. Also, we have got one amount. So my requirement is I would like to present the data in this chart. Uh, I would like to calculate the net sales, net profit and a profit margin. So let's see how to prepare a dashboard for same. So first of all, I switch to click view and create a new click view document, save it on the desktop. And I give a name it as a financial dashboard. Now the first thing I would like to do is I need to load the data. So let me have a look. Where is the data? So data resides on my desktop. That's the data. So I quickly switch to edit a script and load the data table files. And from my desktop, I load the data. That is the financial data. Financial data and open set embedded labels and just make sure that you have that column because we are going to apply the calculation based on that column finish save and reload once the data is reloaded so the first thing i would like to add a region and year and i'll do the customization presentation fixed number of columns three and I arrange them we can also add months as well we can add months as well so I add a new add one more list box for <clears throat> which holds the period. So I look for period here and, and we can give a title months period presentation and six sorting are done load order. And you can see instead of it loads the period it still it is displaying the now we'll be going to prepare the dashboard so to prepare the dashboard right click on the blank area click on chart and i go for combo box combo chart so i go with combo chart in this combo chart my dimension will be period i used as a period dimension next expression the first expression i would like to represent net sales as we have here net sales so the expression will be sum of curly braces dollar sign bracket here financial elements is equal to and we would like to calculate net sales so net 
sales and amount expression is okay okay and i give net it represent as net sales so that's the net sales and we'll do a little bit customization access and uh, now on the second expression will be for net profit so again i click on add and let's copy the same expression i copy this and add paste and instead of net sale this should be net profit okay and net you can see it represents in line graph so when we click on apply you can see the lines are coming so it represents in line net profit and also the legions are also coming net sales net profit heading the title we can change later on once we finish this we'll change the title we can set the title as required like my title should be income statement so i'll get to the caption and change the title to income statement and apply to do more customization we'll switch to numbers and select it set to integer and i'll set this to style we can change the style as required so if you want see the style has been changed earlier it was like this you can see this that's a 3d style so i use a 3d style the final expression is to represent the profit the profit because net sales represents by bar graph net profit represents by uh, line graph next last one will be the profit margin so for display the profit margin again i copy paste and instead of net sales i change this to profit margin this kind of statement is used to call set analysis in click view so profit margin and apply now the profit margin are also coming in lines we want to represent them in dots so i select the profit margin and expression instead of uncheck line and select the symbol and turn into dots apply and get to presentation and increase the symbol size to 4 pt you can see the dots so in this chart you can see the trend lines has been prepared the we, we can uh, the chart has been prepared the dashboard has been prepared with contain net sale net profit profit margin if you don't want to display in a sequential order so we can get to this so sort and we can display according to the numeric values in ascending order or we can turn it into the text in so it will change according to the trends so that's how we can prepare a dashboard and present to the cfo of a company which to display the net sales net profit and profit margin so the at the end we'll get this kind of dashboards that's all in this video in next consecutive videos we'll be going to see few more dashboards in financial analytics to generate reports if you have any queries you can write to us on www.bsptraining.com or bspsolutions.com have a nice day bye